Worm Spirit, who should just jungle at this point. Get your level 6, go back to base. He's got fully completed treads already. Oh, Smail! So low, but the purification keeps him alive. The ball's though, GH is gonna end up dying. No, he gets a heal off barely, but Crit gets him in the end. First blood goes to Crit first, before... That's gonna open up the jungle quite a bit. You can see Matumba Man already making a rotation through. Looks like he's gonna hit the bottom lane here, see if they can take that safe lane tower as well. Runs into crit. Does get a good amount of damage. Disable goes down though. He stops the laps, but he's still gonna take a good amount of damage. But Tumba Man just needs vision right now. Tries to juke it out. Not gonna make it. Samael, low on mana, is now also in trouble here as he starts. Decently, but at the same time, EG not far behind at all. Very neutral game so far is Initiation Miracle. Initiation on a Miracle, this time they do snatch him up, but Motama Man is here and he can also provide the heal if necessary. Instead, they're gonna go for the Shadow Shaman. Easy pickup, evil geniuses. They just seem to be a little bit stymied here. They don't really know where else to go, so they keep on trying to go for this Timbersaw kill, and it's not working out. They're gonna go for bottom lane now. Jump in from Arteezy with a Rappel on top of him. Not much mind control can do. At the same time, Chen ends up going down. Back to bottom lane. So Mail takes a good chunk of damage. All that first magic damage is gonna be enough. Gets a core kill. Get the last hit to Matama Man as another tower gets claimed for Team Liquid. At top lane, though, Ward's gonna spot Arteezy. He's pinging like mad. He really wants something out of this. Look at Miracle. Spots Just Miracle once there. again. He's already got the reactive armor stack, so it's gonna be a tough kill. And he's got the paralyzed There's cast. The dead one. Position. Hey, Miracle dropping lower and lower. Gets it's so much damage. damage. Takes the timber saw. Miracle jumping away. Arteezy so down low, low trying to finish him off with the magic damage. Not enough. GH keeps him alive. He's and out of Arteezy mana. is completely out of mana. He's shot and he's down. Miracle. He baits evil geniuses. The top Arteezy zips in. Off the pull. Back, but there is Matumba Man here, and he's gonna help out Miracle now. Pops down, kind of baits it. Now, Samael is one in trouble. He has to repel himself up. Repel's not gonna last long, though. Miracle's still gonna go for the kill. He gets a good amount of damage. They need a little bit more. Tries to get the hill off, but surprise, the wand is still there. The Nether Ward takes him down, and now Radiant's another top tower top may be dropping. Mid lane. Trying to go on my control here. Man, get the shackles up. The toss is there, though. Here comes GH. Get the heal. And my control turns on Chris. Gets a good amount of damage to get the cleave of the spirits. They managed to take down Shadow. MC's got blink. Now a toss over to RTV. They take him as well. Liquid are just non stop destroying evil geniuses. Always going to be a Wisp and a Witch Doctor that can provide the heals necessary. Flying Timber saw another jump forward by RTZ with the send back from the Chen. They're just trying to get little bits of damage in so they can finally make a full-on commitment. Another TP back play from the Storm Spirit. Now they're low enough, maybe they can play for this one. Samael trying to challenge, but gets stunned up. Dead, dead Ward gets the toss up. Managed to get the chains done enough to be able to bring him down. No heals come out. RTZ trying to go for GH still. He's the one target that can be low enough and managed to force to relocate. For the moment, they hold that as Spear Sunders out, but for the most part, everyone on Liquid relatively healthy. GH gonna come back with a full bottle. Liquid, so much heals on their side with the Witch Doctor at the same time, and here they come. Oh, done, Crit, he's already down. RTZ has to jump away. He's far too low, and that means they're gonna give up that melee Rex. Oh, Crit. A little bit more. Here, doesn't have thunder. Too much. Oh no, he didn't have the Sunder. The burst damage is overwhelming. Evil geniuses, they can't possibly stop this. He may be able to get one kill. Kuro, he still managed to get the paralyzing cast, bounce over the Samael, and managed to get the combo stun with the avalanche. But finally, Liquid will call the retreat with a buyback coming out from the Chen and a full lane of racks taken by Samael. Mind control, he's in this up. All right, Mind control's gonna go for it here. He managed to get off the ultimate from Samael, but it's still something forced out of Evil Geniuses. A guard times. Mind control setting up for this up at the bottom. Okay, one shot him. There's the hit. RTZ does manage to get off the wand. That's definitely going to be needed here, as you can see how low he drops. Now he's going to try and kite around mind control, but DH is here. Careful his spirits, they do have the purification. Oh, he's committing that to the speed, but they manage to get the toss round. Repel goes down. They're going to be able to control mind control up. Samael is definitely trying to focus on GH to make sure there's no extra assistance from him, and does manage to kill him before the TP out. Have a wisp at all times. If anybody gets gone on, GH already has a fully completed mech at just 19 minutes into the game. It's going to be quite difficult for anyone to go down on the side of Liquid, as now they're going to start their march again. Gonna try to make his way into the trees, but spirit, a spirit ball pinks him. They know where Crit is. They're going to be able to get that pick off. Another Bloodstone charge for Miracle as Lane of Rax. And Storm Spirit does finish the Orchid now. But how useful is that going to be as Liquid? 20 stacks on this Timber Saw. He's just 
eating away at this tower slowly. Between the Bloodstone as well as the Hum, they're gonna be able to jump on Matumba Man. That's a big kill if they can get it. He's silent up as well. They're definitely trying to finish him up, but GH is keeping him alive. Now he can turn, gets up the drain onto Thunder. No, it doesn't go off in time. Fear again brought down another drain. This time it's gonna be Chen who falls. A toss back on his mail. And Liquid, they've taken enough of Evil Geniuses down. They're going to throw the Tier 3. Misery doesn't even know what to say at this point in time. What a toss into the drain as well. RTZ is left no alone dying. against the Tide of Thank Team you. Liquid. Everyone is still pretty much at full HP despite all of that. Mind control tosses Miracle off in the air. Every single time. Here's like... RTZ doing another zip. Trying to do whatever he can to slow down this push, but once they seem to get on top of that tower, it doesn't seem to matter, and that's why they're gonna go for the smoke. Their last desperation play. Radiance top tower is under As Liquid go for their own smoke. Wrap around of the high ground here. Here comes the jump going for Matumba Man. GH has tucked his way into the trees. He's gonna be able to keep Matumba Man alive. They got the paralyzing cap on RTZ. They're blowing up a lot of these heroes. Samil, he's gonna end up going down here. A miracle just slices him down. Ultra kill for Miracle. And evil geniuses call it. 22 minutes into the game. I mean, Liquid have a whopping 25 kills, more than one a minute.